Hey guys, it's me, Drew, and I'm here to do a collective shopping haul. Um, I've done some shopping online, in stores, and I just wanted to film them all together because I didn't get a lot from each store, I but I went to a bunch of different stores. The first place I went was Loxodon because if you spent $65... On Thursday or Friday, which was yesterday or today, which I went today, you had to get reservations. You could get a free tote bag. And this is a very nice tote bag. It says Loxaton on the side. There's something on the bottom. It says Thursday and Friday inside. It's really a nice bag if you spent $65. And that's like two items at Loxaton. So the first item that I picked up was the Lavender Cleansing Hand Wash. I do have the big 16.9 ounce of the Verbena Hand Wash. But I wanted to try the lavender, and this was $20. Th this smells just like a lavender field. It's absolutely amazing. It's great for the summer. I'm using up my Bath & Body Works hand soaps, so I can start using the more luxurious and gentle hand washes. Then, whenever the Today Special Value on QVC had the little 8.4 ounce size of the almond oil, the almond shower oil, I loved it. And you basically pump it, or pour it on your body, it, it looks like an oil, just like any standard oil, and then whenever you add water to it, it just sus suds up, creates an amazing lather, you rinse it, it just feels amazing. You don't need lotion after. And the small size I think is like $30. They have a big size for $50 that I've always wanted to try, but never got the chance. So I picked it up yesterday, and it is the shower oil, and this was $48. It's a pump, and then you just pump it. So I figured I will keep this... Um, on my shelf and then use the shower oil and just refill with the shower oil. So those were the two products that I picked up at Loxaton. I went to Bath and Body Works during the 2 for 22 sale and I picked up three of the new winter market candles. I picked up a sugared lemons which reads sweet on citrus zesty lemons blended with sweet sugar crystals and a hint of red raspberry adds a citrusy sparkle to winter nights. This reminds me just of the Lemoncello candle, which I still have one of them. I love, love, love a lemon scented candle, and the Bath & Body Works lemon candles are really, really, really nice. So I figured that's great for the summertime, even though it's a winter candle. The Winter Vanilla Latte. And this one says, Winter Invite, let's do coffee. Please join us for a smooth and creamy blend of premium vanilla beans and luscious caramel topped by decadent whipped cream. This smells just like a latte. You smell the coffee, the whipped cream, the sugar. You get everything in there. So this is a great candle. Very relaxing for the kitchen, I would say. That's where I'm going to burn it. And then Sparkling Berries and Pears. This is a gorgeous, like, fuchsia color. And this one says, Step 1, combine winter's best berries and juicy pear nectar. Step 2, add dashes of tangy black currant and a touch of effervescence. And Step 3, enjoy. This smells like Cranberry Pear Bellini, just stronger. It's really, really, really nice. I then went to QVC and Sephora because, if you know, I love Josie Marin's Argon Oil products. And the first product that I wanted to try was her brand new seasonal body butter in Be Comforted, which is Apple Crisp. And it looks like this, and this was $29, I believe, on QVC. And this is the 8-ounce standard size. Now, if you can see, her body butters are so whipped and so decadent. And they're infused with argon oil, so when you put them on your body, they just melt right into your skin. They feel incredible. I am obsessed with her body butters. I put them on every single night after I get out of the shower, and I've done that for about two weeks now. And I can tell that my arms and my legs and my whole body look so much healthier from using the body butters from Josie Marin. And argon oil is a rare and precious ingredient that only grows in one area of Morocco, and it's just an amazing ingredient. It's amazing because it, it's not thick. Like, it doesn't go on your skin thick, but it's so ultra-hydrating, 
and they cr she creates seasonal scents every year, every certain season. Like um, for the summertime was Be Refreshed, which is like cucumber and aloe. Which whenever it's the summertime with the sunburn and stuff, cucumber and aloe really helps to s heal. And for the winter, this is Apple Crisp. And this literally smells like an apple crisp. It smells like, it reminds me, which is really weird, of the Keurig hot apple cider. That is what this reminds me of. Exactly. When you brew that, it smells just like this. It's really awesome. So, I'm trying to save this. I just, I absolutely love it, and I love her packaging. Now, that's the standard 8-ounce. She had, for a limited time only, the big 13.5-ounce, which she only gets one order every single season of, and it is the Argon Oil. Just turn my phone off in case I get any text messages. I got a new skin for my iPhone as well. But anyway, so these big ones are $43.96. And that is an incredible value. I got mine as a one time only for $39, though. But the big ones are, or the small ones are $35. So for almost twice as much product, you're getting it. I got mine for $4 more. And this is in the scent Sweet Citrus, which is the one that I put on like every morning. It just smells like a burst of tangerine. It's the same consistency. Because Argon Oil, you can use all over your body, but. It's so expensive, and it's so rare that you don't want to put the oil all over your body, so they whipped it up into this amazing texture. Then the other one that I got is in Vanilla Apricot. They had one other choice, which was unscented, but that sold out. And the Vanilla Apricot, I've had both of these in the small 8-ounce size. I wanted to pick them up in the larger size, and I've used quite a bit of the Vanilla Apricot. This one's very relaxing. I like to put this on before I go to bed. But if you can see, you probably can't, but your my arm looks so healthy. It looks... It doesn't look, or it doesn't feel greasy. It just feels so soft, so hydrating. Now, she has a product like Petroleum Jelly, but it has so many more benefits, and it's the Argon Infinity Creamy Oil. I picked this up at Sephora because it was the same price as it is on QVC. $28. This is sealed, so I'm not going to open this. But it's just like a Petroleum Jelly. It's in that sweet citrus scent, and it just has more benefits for you than does exactly the same as Petroleum Jelly, chap lips, hair, face, skin, everything. It's like a liquid band-aid, but it actually has benefits for you like argon oil does. And the last argon oil product I have is the Argon Balm, which you can use everywhere. It's intensive all over moisture and repair for your feet, hair, face, everything, lips. And it looks like this, and I haven't I just used a tiny, like, I just went like this with my finger, but it's argon oil. 20% of this container is argon oil, and this is 4.6 ounces. Did I say 20? 50%. Two ounces of argon oil is in here. It's a, Yeah, I think it's 50%. I don't remember. Yeah, I think it's 50% argon oil in this container. So most products that say argon oil have like 10 drops of argon oil, if that. This has 50%. All of her products, that's the main ingredient. Every product of hers, her lipsticks, her foundations, her lotions, everything has argon oil in it. So that's an absolutely amazing product. And the last items were from the Body Shop. Um, the Body Shop had a 40% off sale. Oh no, that's not the last thing, sorry. The Body Shop had a 40% off sale, and plus I am a Love Your Body member, so I got an extra 10% off. And we had a Groupon, $20 gift card for 10 So I picked up the super large 25.3 ounce strawberry shower gel to match the body butter that I have. And this is a sumptuous soap-free cleansing with strawberry seed oil and community fair trade honey. So their products are soap-free which is an absolutely incredible thing because it lathers a little bit. It doesn't super lather, but it still gets you very nice and clean. Now, you know my favorite scent from the body shop right now. The newest scent is the Honey Mania. So I wanted to try their Honey Mania shower gel. And this is the normal size. It's 8.4 ounces. I got the shower gel for like $9 for the big one, and I got this one for $4.80. I love this smell. The Honey Mania Shower Gel, I could just dive in it. It's an absolutely amazing product. I still want to try the bath mat in it. I picked up one full-size body butter. I picked up the Brazil Nut. I already have one of these, and I remember I made a video that said, well, this isn't 
centered, really. I mean, it's almost uncentered, but I had to pick up another one because I used almost all of my other one because the scent that it does leave you after a while, it just becomes this amazing nutty scent. I really like that. I picked up a small Chocomania body butter for a friend because I already have the Chocomania body butter. I have every body butter. And then I picked up a mini Shea body butter, which is my favorite scent from ever in the body shop. Honey Mania is my favorite new scent, which, I mean, that's like, I've been obsessed over that, but Shea is my go-to. Like, they need to come out with the jumbo size Shea shower cream, because if they came out with this size in jumbo, I'd buy 20. And then I picked up their body mists. I picked up two, and I love these. These are glass bottles, and I picked up the mango body mist, and I believe that there's no alcohol in these because it says all over body spray because whenever you spray them on your body, it doesn't leave, like you don't smell an alcohol -y note. It just smells amazing. So I picked up the mango one because I have the super size body butter, the super size body scrub, and now I have the spray. And then, obviously, the Shea Body Mist, because this is my favorite scent of all time from the body shop. The Honey Mania they did have in the EDT, which is the smaller bottle, but I didn't pick that up. Lastly, I went to Victoria's Secret, because there was 7 for 35 body care, and I decided to pick some things up. I picked up the Pink Pretty and Pure Luminous Body Butter, and it's like a purple color. It smells... Amazing. Um, does it say it says feel pretty in jasmine and pink lemonade, and that's what it smells like. I like this body care a lot better than I like Bath and Body Works body care. And then ready to party, which is get ready to party in pink lotus flower and apple. Just very light, very refreshing for the spring and summertime. So I'm probably gonna save these for that time. And I love the um, packaging. I love how they are like silvery. Cool. And it's actually, I believe, look at it, it matches almost perfectly to the candle. Look at that. Then I picked up the Sparkling Citrus Body Butter. These are all for gifts. It smells very citrusy, nothing very special about that. I picked up the Sheer Love Body Butter. Which again, this one is white sit white cotton and pink lily. It does. It smells amazing. I also picked up the EDT in that. So it looks like this. The body spray and the shower gel in that set. And then lastly, the Mango Temptation Body Butter, which is mango nectar and hibiscus. This one's my favorite ever. It's so mango-y, so fruity, so delicious. And I got the shower gel and the spray in that. So that was my body shop, Victoria's Secret, L'Occitane, Bath & Body Works, QVC, and Sephora, Josie Marin, Hall. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'm sure I'll be back before the holidays. But if not, there's 11 days till Christmas. See ya!